Hi, I'm Dan Gerwitz from College Humor, and right now, I'm about to take a shower with a beautiful girl! But while I'm definitely psyched to have shower sex, it's not always the passionate romp that you think it's gonna be. For instance, I don't have those little grippy things on the floor, so while I hope things end up like this, Yo, Gabba Gabba! They could easily end up like this. Either way, I probably didn't have time to clean out all the embarrassing stuff, so while we f we'll be staring at my prescription seborrheic dermatitis shampoo, which we'll probably end up having to use as lube, since, surprise, water makes your vajay feel like the inside of an old balloon. But, say things go great. Say I actually figure out how to position myself, even though I'm taller than you, it's like a Death Star trench run. And neither one of us bumps into the hot water now. Ah! And we have super hot coitus. Because I said quit it. Yeah. Well, after that, we are supposed to clean ourselves too, right? But then, I don't understand the rules. Like, what parts of your body am I allowed to wash? I know I get to wash your boobs. That's a given. Women in movies are always washing their boobs. It's like the only thing they wash. I mean, you never see this. <laughs> Women in movies should have bright, shiny boobs and just be caked with shit everywhere else. Hey, can I get some of that water? I'm freezing. The point is, I know it's awkward, but like, you gotta wash other places. If we just do the chest wash thing, then we get out of the shower for the rest of the day, I'm thinking, this girl didn't wash her butthole. Her butt crack and her butthole. I almost wanna tell people. Hey everybody, this girl's acting like she washed her butt crack and her butthole, but she did it. She has a crack of lies. You know what? I'm thinking too hard. I think I just need to relax and do what I would normally do in the shower. Wish me luck. Mm. <laughs> Are you peeing?